Welcome back to German Traditional Clothing. Today we're talking about Atlanta Tracht. This area is close to Hamburg and Lower Saxony. It was actually colonized by Dutch folks in the 12th and 13th century. In fact, it was kind of an independent land until the 1930s. It's a marshland, so they have really good soil, so there are a lot of wealthy farmers. As we know, this leads to very opulent Tracht. This is the bridal headdress, the Flunkranz. Those two wings are supposed to represent the blades of a windmill. You can see the Dutch influence, right? Not only are they super cool, but they remind me a little bit of cookies in the best way. Wealthier brides were also known to wear a six meter long silver chain intertwined in 44 different silver hooks. Men would wear a blue suit on their wedding day and they had some nice bling as well. This is a typical watch chain for men. Women actually covered their hair most of the time, if not all the time. This was the attire for Holy Communion, which includes this really heavy amber necklace. And this was typical dress for married women during festivals. There's a bow on the side and a shawl around the neck called a vus. Okay, see you next time. Tschüss!